Hey boys and girls, Jester here, and welcome to the court. You're probably wondering what the court is, and it's a bit of a long story. This is my new Sunday show. It's going to be a recap of the week, or in this case anyway, because it's the first one. This is a. This is what's going to be happening for weeks from now on, and it's all in beta form at the minute. So you're gonna to have to bear with me if there's going to be hiccups here and there. You know, there's a reason behind why I'm doing all this, and well, I'm here to explain this to you in this first episode of the call. Now, as many of you know, I work full time. Uh, I think most of us are starting out do because it doesn't really pay to do what we do as LPs or anything else. And also I'm a writer, or aspiring writer, and these things take up a lot of my time. So, when I've been doing LPs in the past, it's literally, that's the only time I've sat down to play a game. Which is why there are always longer gameplays that I then chunk up, so I've got videos in hand, like a backlog of videos that I can put out. I'm changing all that now. From now on I'm making time to play more games, because I miss playing video games, because I love video games. Now, so, this is going to reflect on the LPs as well, because I still want to be doing that. Whereas we've been having like chunks of longer gameplays in pretty much every game of play, we're stopping that now. The only game that's going to be continuing with is Prince of Persia. Every weekday there'll still be a 10-15 to 15 minute episode of Prince of Persia recorded in one long gameplay and then chunked into five pieces. But also on weekdays you'll be getting a half an hour in one of five different games. And on a Saturday there's going to be a slightly longer episode of Saints Row 3. That's because I want to get through Saints Row 3 as fast as possible because Saints Row 4 comes out at the end of August. And it's also because you're not getting a Prince of Persia on a Saturday, so, you know, extra 10 minutes onto a half hour of Saints Row, you know, you get. And then every Sunday you'll be getting another one of these, the court. It's going to be a recap of the week, not necessarily on my channel, it's going to be a chance for me to talk about anything I've got on my mind from the week. Maybe it's a really good video that I saw, or maybe it's something I've seen in the news or in media. It could just as easily be me ranting on about nothing in particular. Now as for exactly what games you'll be getting from me on the weekdays, these are as follows. Just one second, let's get to uh, put my uh, readers on here. On Sundays, like today, you'll be getting an installment of The Court. And possibly a surprise, I forgot to mention this, on Sundays there will also possibly be surprises every now and then. This can be as... let me just take these up. Uh, these can be anything from as simple as multiplayer I've done with friends that I've recorded. Or it could be another Fools Around, it's been a long time since I've done one of them. That was actually my first video, I think. It was my Fools Around in Portal 1. I'll be getting a couple more of them if I find time. On Mondays, it will be The Last of Us. A half an hour playthrough of The Last of Us. I have already played a bit of this game. Dear Lord, it is fantastic. On Tuesdays, it will be Borderlands 2 that is sticking with us. We're going to be carrying on with that until the very end of it, obviously. Why else do an LP if you're not going to go the whole way? Wednesdays we're going to be playing a modded version of Skyrim, and I know, I know what you're saying, everybody plays Skyrim, but I love Skyrim, even despite how old it is, so I'm, I'm doing it because I want it, alright, good, fine, you alright with that? Good, you should be. And plus we've also got mods on it anyway, so it's going to make things a little bit more interesting. can't actually remember what mods I've got. On Thursdays we will be continuing The Walking Dead. I don't know why I'm reading this, I don't really need to. On Thursdays we will be continuing The Walking Dead because, man alive, that is a good game. And hopefully soon I'll be getting my hands on The Walking Dead 400 Days as well, by the way. So we'll be continuing that after we finish the first five episodes. And on Fridays we're going to be continuing on in Halo 4. These aren't even real, by the way, look. No class in them whatsoever. <laughs> And as I said, we're going to be continuing Prince of Persia every day as well anyway, because I love Prince of Persia. But they'll only be 10 to 15 minutes long, as opposed to the half an hour you get in the games. Yeah, so that's how you have it, boys and girls. That's uh, five weekdays, you're going to be getting a half an hour in a different game, plus a 10 minute playthrough of uh, Prince of Persia, that will be got in one long chunk and then split into pieces, because I just feel that game in particular, it's quite repetitive. As good as it is, it's quite repetitive, so those 10 minutes, just put in stacks, you know, you know, like, you, you know, you know. And then you're half an hour in The Last of Us, Borderlands 2, Modded Skyrim, The Walking Dead, and Halo 4. And a slightly longer episode of Saints Row 3 on a Saturday, until Saints Row 4 comes out in August. 
and another one of the court every Sunday, which will be me blabbering on about anything I feel like. Now I know also that this isn't exactly great quality, I'm still working with a subpar camera as far as video recording goes. It's a brilliant photo camera, because it was made for, it just has a video function. That video function isn't amazing. But I do have some fancy lighting, I've got my uh, set. And this is just what I'm going to be trying to do from now on. I'm going to be getting hands on a new camera soon, hopefully, as well. So what you can expect from me is better quality in editing, better quality in gameplay, more variety in my gameplay, and just me having more fun, hopefully. But as I said before, this is all beta phase. Might not work long run, but we're going to be giving it a shot anyway. And for anybody out there who's wondering why I've chosen the name of the court, if you haven't figured that out already, that's... A little bit worrying. You don't even have to be a friend of mine or even a fan of mine, if I've even got those, to realise the connection between Jester and Court. And it's basically because you guys are coming here to basically see me make a fool out of myself, because that's pretty much what I do. But just on that side note, I'll probably start calling you guys Nobles as well, because I'm basically doing this to entertain you guys. Who else is a Jester and Stain? Uh, that's it from me guys, thanks for listening and thanks for watching, uh, a like and a subscription will be very much appreciated if you like what you see, and you can do me an extra special favour by going out and checking my writing on uh, justexceptions.blogspot.co.uk. I write a series called Blaze, which is kind of like a superhero sci-fi kind of thing, that's out on Wednesday mornings, and there's a supernaturally demony kind of thing called The Hunters that's released every Sunday morning. So again, thanks for watching, a like and a subscription will be very much appreciated, and I will see you through the week.